led by 11th year head coach Brian Hall, the Hillers girls cross country team is back at practice and getting ready for the season. This will be my 11th season, uh, started in 2006. Um, I've run 20 marathons and uh, now I live vicariously through, uh, through my, my female athletes here. Um, so we're the team captains and what that means is that we will like um, kind of lead the team in like warm ups and all that stuff and like be available for questions and then we just plan events for the team to do together throughout the season. This year, there are high expectations for the experienced Tillers girls cross country team. Well, we uh, graduated no one from my top 12 and we've added at least three real solid runners. So we have high hopes for the season. If I can just keep them healthy, then uh, good things will follow. Um, Preseason polls are out and we're ranked fourth in all of Massachusetts. So now we've got to live up to that. Yeah, so we have a lot of returning runners, which is great. Almost everyone last year um, who's on varsity is returning. Actually, I think everyone is mm-hmm. returning. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, and plus we do have um, some new uh, people on the team that we think will be pretty good this year. So we're hoping to go pretty far. I asked what the team has been working on during the first few practices. Yeah, so we've been doing lots of different kinds of workouts. We started with... Um, We'll do tempo miles, which are slower than your race pace, but faster than your average run pace. And we'll do maintenance runs, which are just maintenance miles. They're easy miles just to get your miles up. Um, and tomorrow we're having a two mile time trial on the track. So kind of like a preseason, a way to measure your um, progress throughout the summer and to see how the team is stacking up for the fall. Uh, we're starting to inject some hills, uh, no speed work yet, just um, trying to see who's fit after a, a summer where, you know, I'm not allowed to coach during the summer, so uh, the captains are kind of in charge of organizing runs, and uh, so far so good, it looks good. Cross-country programs have grown across the state, but just in case you don't exactly know what cross-country is, Coach Brian Hall explained. Championship races are over uh, five kilometers, which is 3.1 miles. Um, It can be a variety of uh, terrain, hills, grass, dirt, trails. Um, Challenging sport. I mean, you can, some people's goal is just to finish these races. So uh, it's kind of a cool sport. It's a no cut sport. We get cuts from other other sports. Um, Some people are just trying to get in shape for the winter sport. Other people are among, we have some that are among the best athletes in the entire state who are going to be scholarship caliber. I asked the captains what makes the girls cross country team worth following this season. One of the strongest teams in the school. We have a lot of fun. Um, We're just like a fun group of people. And um, yeah, I think that the team dynamic is a lot different than other sports. We're very inclusive. No matter your skill level, you're welcome here and you can be a part of our running family. Yeah.